a lot of people wouldn't expect to see a tech-based website in an art gallery. So this is very much an art project that turned a lot into a technological-based web project. It was interesting though because even with it just being a mock-up, I had to look into so many different things about web design and about usability, user in interface, and UX design because I wouldn't want to make something that's just a dream. And so I talked to different web developers about how my website works because it's all based on customization and saving things for later and then moving things around based on location. So if there's a museum and a restaurant and a park that are near each other, it'll put those on the same day. And then you choose which days you want to do these different activities. And then you select the ones that you're the most interested in. And then you can either download, which would be like on an iPad or a phone, or print your um, itinerary for your trip so you can take it with you. I've learned more about how, as a fine arts major, how I can sort of become a woman in technology, even though that might not be exactly what I'm studying, but my major can sort of stem from the things that I've learned working at CWIT.